Hi loves, it's Ashley Sandrine. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we are going to be cooking something very exciting. But first, I do have a special guest. <laughs> it's my cousin, Brent. Hi loves, it's me, Brent. <laughs> Ashley's cousin. So for today's video, actually he was the one who found the recipe. So get explain mo. Yeah, so since it's such a huge trend nowadays, na madami mga bakes like sushi or sushi nachos. Sushi bake, nacho bake. Naisipan namin why not do something that we both really enjoy like pizza, gano. So yun, naisipan namin why not try to look it up sa internet like mm. pizza, pizza bake or something like that. So yun, we found the recipe and that's what we're gonna do today. Mm -hmm. Gagawa kami ng pizza bake. Madali lang siya gawin. Very actually. simple. Very, very simple. So, yeah, so we are gonna show you the ingredients first and then we'll show you how to do it. Okay, so for the ingredients. Ayan, we prepared 220 grams of cream cheese, half a cup of milk, one cup of pasta sauce, and then. We prepared also one half cup of mozzarella. Tapos itong cheddar, we prepared three fourths. Mm -hmm. Pero it really depends on your preference. Pwede kayo mag three cheese. So kung tatlong cheese yung gagamitin nyo, one fourth each lang. Mm -mm. So, yeah. Anything that's available naman sa inyo, yeah. that's easy to find. And then, of course, we have bread. Pero pwede naman pandesal or wheat, wheat bread. Wheat white bread. bread. Mm -mm. Kung anong meron kayo sa house, that's why it's very nice and easy to do. And then more mozzarella to top it off later. And then um, instead of pepperoni, wala kami. So we used salami instead. But you guys can use ham or anything that you have at home. Okay, so we are starting with the cream cheese. We're gonna put it in the saucepan. So give it a go. Oops. It has to be softened. And then we're gonna pour in the milk as well. So next, you pour in the mozzarella. Actually, that's the most important because it's pizza, diba? So, yeah. And then next, we're gonna pour in the cheddar. Kami, we just use cheddar because it's what we have at home. Mm -hmm. But kayo, whatever you guys have or whatever is more convenient for you guys, I separate nyo siya into like one fourth, depending kung alam yung cheese nyo. Mm -hmm. So yun yung gamitin natin. So ayun, the next step now is to just keep mixing until it forms a certain thick texture. So nakita niyo naman, sobrang laki ko naman. Ang ganda nung nagkukuk para sa amin dito. Okay, so I mixed it kanina, but Brent is gonna help me. Medyo matagal yung stirring niya. Like, takes a few minutes then to melt it all. And it it helps if you, like, cut the cream cheese. Yeah, para kasi medyo makapal pa yung cream cheese at the start. So, yeah. Go, Brent. <laughs> Chef. <laughs> Take out the clumps. Uh, pagbala ng buo-buo na. Mm -mm. Para malapit na. Para siyang arm workout actually. Mm. <laughs> so, dapat equal both arms. <laughs> I think that's okay na, no? Yeah. Ayan. So, this is the kind of texture that we're trying to achieve mm -hmm. by mixing, you know, the cheese and the milk. Okay, so... After mixing it, we've already achieved the texture that we wanted. So Brent and I are going to transfer it into this glass dish. Kailangan kasi glass kasi we're going to put it in the oven later. Which you guys should preheat. Um, and you have to wait till you reach uh, 200... 25 degrees. 25, 25 degrees. to 250 degrees. Yeah. Okay, 
So lagay mo na dyan. Okay, so we flattened it. Ito yung cheese kanina that we melted. Tapos, next is... Yes. You're gonna put the tomato sauce on top now. Tapos, yung natira natin cheddar, diba? We put a little cheddar sa side. You mm -hmm. just put everything on top but it's more cheesy. And then to top everything off, you could put whatever you want naman. You could put salami, pepperoni, ham. Gusto nyo lagay nyo ng pineapple yan no, if you prefer Hawaiian. pineapple. So, whatever you prefer, that's what we could do. Okay, so we are going to put the tomato sauce and the next step is we put tomato sauce on top. The shampoo we try to spread it as even as possible para lahat ng sides ng pizza dip natin may tomato sauce. So we put the tomato sauce on top already. So the next is yung natirang cheddar. Uh -huh. That's what we're gonna put on top. Okay, so we decided to add more cheese para naman mas even siya and yeah. so, of course, mas, mas masarap. Mas cheesy. Yeah. Mas masarap pag mas cheesy. Ayan, so the final step, syempre you top it with the toppings you want. Pwedeng meat, giniling, ham, mga bell peppers, if you guys want it, you know, mga veggies, okay, whatever you guys want. Okay, this is how it looks like before putting it in the oven. Yes, so this is what we prepared. Na Everything is topped off. Now the next step is to just put it in the oven for 8 to 10 minutes until it is kind of golden brown. We preheated the oven for 30 minutes. 30 minutes, minutes yeah. ago. So that should be enough. Okay, sige. You can put it there now. Let's rest it Oh, we are done and we're going to... Finally! I'm so excited. excited. Mom, it looks really, really good. Mm -hmm. So, we have our toasted bread right here. And then we did dip lang namin siya. And it should oh. be perfect. <laughs> okay. Finished product name. It looks really good, I promise. <laughs> Dikita, mm -hmm. but wait. Sige, go Brent. Try it. Mm. Oh my god, it's so good. It's really good. I love it. Mm. <gasps> Tama lang yung pagka cheesy ne. I mean, uh, based on my preference. If you guys want it more cheesy, pwede pa naman kaya magdagdag. Pero sakto lang. No? It's really good. And then, Yung tomato sauce gives it a bit of sweetness. Because we use the Filipino style pasta sauce, so yeah. matamisha, so I like that. It's really good. It's super good. Or if gusto nila, they could even use like chips or something. Mm -hmm. Kung ano nung gusto niyo, so yeah, it's very nice because it's up to you, whatever you prefer. 
or whatever is more convenient sa sa house niyo, de ba? Kung ano mayo na trip nyo lang gumawa ng pizza, mm -hmm. lang, de ba? Ang sarap niya super. Okay, you guys. So we're gonna try um, nacho chips. Mm -hmm. Wala lang. Para we can see if it's good there. Pero yeah. I feel like it will be. So of we'll just dip it. Ooh, cheers. Mm, cheers. Cheers. Huh. Mm. Oh. I love it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not going to Perfect to per get together. Mm -hmm. the Sorry if you guys are watching a movie. It's me. It's me. It's me. It's me. It's Tapo super dali lang, so mm -hmm. 8 to 10 minutes lang siya. Okay, so that is basically it for the whole recipe and like whole procedure of making the pizza bake. It's so good. good. It's, <laughs> you guys should try it 100%. Tag us, tag the both of us if you decide to do it. What's your Instagram name? Uh, KBQ. KBQ. Spell it, spell it. K A Y B E E Q Y O O. Please don't forget to hit the like button, click subscribe if you haven't yet, and click on that bell notification button so that you guys get notified every time I post a new video. I will see you guys in my next one. Thank you for watching, loves. Bye! Bye!